everyone this is john from civil center welcome to our channel as we know civil center is continuously working with the vision to guide civil engineering students and professionals and for that we keep making videos on different software today we are going to learn how to modify a sketchup model so right now i am using the paint bucket tool and i am changing the color of my model so Let's see what are the difficulties that you can face while working on a random model. So over here, you can see that while using the paint bucket tool, when I try to paint this particular portion, then I am getting a different color. So that happened because we have a surface over here. So what you can do in that, you can just remove the surface and then you can continue using your paint tool. So, while removing the surface, one difficulty that you can also face is that you can delete the surface. So, there are two ways of doing that. First, either you can move the surface away or second, you can just delete the surface and copy it from other place. So, if I am trying to modify it, I will have to change all the color because if you will not change all the color and you will think that okay from the front view this color will not be visible then that is not the right way of doing things if you are changing any color then you will have to change it properly and sometimes you will have to enter the group and then you can apply the color so over here you can see i have just entered the group deleted the unnecessary portions and then changed the color of it now if I will just accidentally delete it, then what I can do is that I can undo the process and bring it back. The other thing that I can do is I will simply change the color and copy the object from the other portions. Because in SketchUp, you will have multiple copies of same element. So it's not a thing to worry. Now. I have imported this model from the warehouse and I am modifying it according to my need. Okay, so in the warehouse, you will find a bunch of models like this and you can simply modify them and make them of your use. So like I have used the solar panels from there and I have just used the solar panel in my model and deleted the rest of the portions. So this is how you can change the color. Suppose you want to apply tiles on a roof and the balcony. Then I can apply it simply by picking one from the existing tiles. Or if you want, then you can also choose the tile from your existing tiles option. So now you can see I have done what I have just copied the balcony over here so this way you can also copy the balcony so i will just show you the process again how i did that okay so over here i got a surface so i deleted the surface but instead of like losing it uh, for the whole time i can just copy and place the another balcony over here now Let's try to put another tile on the balcony and you can try this as many times as you want so that you can get the best view. Now I'm increasing the size of the tiles so that I can have a better view. So even changing the size of the tiles and any other material that is there in SketchUp is very easy. All you have to do is to go to edit and then you can change the sizes. Now, suppose I am not liking this one then I can go and choose another one and I can again set the dimension for that so this is a hit and trial method which I am using in a sketchup so that I can give a better look to my model so if you want to join our classes then all you have to do is to click on the link given in the description and I will personally give you a call so guys, that was all for today. If you like this video, hit the like button, share it with your friends and colleagues and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.